Bats. I love that little clown. This stupid little bastard. Okay, 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 okay. Look at this. Just like in real life, baby, I jump in the trash. And I get the fucking game. So a small haul. Not a good one. We did. We will be taking calls during the haul alert hour to make up for the uh, lack of games. So, um, uh, I think they made Rockstar made a BMX game. Uh, I think you're right. I think you're right, but I don't know which one it would be. Um, oh, it's busy. It's so busy, baby. <laughs> Oh! It's so busy in here! Young boy. Oh, it's Young loud. Boy. It's. I see the soundboard. It is clipping. It is so loud. It is so proud. We got games to look into. It's a small fucking hall. It's a small fucking hall. It's a small fucking hall because it's a small fucking hall. It's a small fucking hall, but it's a small fucking hall. I think this is, is gonna be a small haul. Um, it is what it is. It is what it fucking is. Thank you for the bits, young boys, new toys. Talk about it once, talk about it twice. Blast off into the haul alert. Thank you for that segment. Uh, it, <laughs> incredible stuff going on today. Not incredible haul. So first one, duplicate, duplicate games. That's how bad the haul alert's been. Ian, I'm sorry. Listen, dude, I, I apologize profusely. I know that you guys are subscribing, and I appreciate that. And I want to, I want to make it up for you, to you guys. Uh, I thought that this was a false sealed game for a second. Um, duplicate game. I got it for the uh, the bonus turbo disc, turbo mode disc. Dogecoin is down right now. I just got an alert. Uh, so losing money on all fronts, uh, but it's Ridge Racer Type 4, aka R4. Why am I fucking burping so much? Um, I have had this game. I've been trying to sell this game to the exchange for about $3 and a slap on the ass. Um, they won't take it. The game has gone up in value significantly. God, what's with these they won't take burps? it. <laughs> it's not fucking baby burps, you little bitch. I'm sorry, Brandon. I'm so sorry. It's, it's the, it's the R4 talking. Um, so we got the disc. We got the manual. Uh, so they would not accept this game. And because on the back, we got two discs. As you see underneath that white car there, we got two discs on the fucking board, which means they think, or the exchange thinks that this is a two disc game. This is not a two disc game. It's one fucking disc right here. R4. Here's the manual. Um, the second disc is this Ridge Racer bonus turbo mode disc. So, I just recently got I got it in the mail today. The turbo mode bonus disc. I, I don't know why I even did it because the game is worth like maybe 35, 40 bucks. Um the dirt the turbo fuck mode disc. Um yeah, dude, I'm that's what I'm saying. I mean it, it sounds cool as hell. It's the bonus turbo mode fuck hole disc. Um R4 is very good. Very cool story. I agree with you. Very amazing music, amazing soundtrack. This game got me back into EDM music. Um, <clears throat> I found a Spotify playlist that had like, <clears throat> uh, it said it was like music from the game. It wasn't music from the game, but it's just music um, in the same light. So bonus turbo mode disc completes this piece of shit game. That's great. I'm just a little bitch about it. Um, so I'm adding it to the fucking game list because as you can tell, we're at 972 games, which is immaculate. That's a lot of games. The reason being is I have included games. I have re gone through. I've added all the duplicate games I've had in the past. Um, it compares the cruise in the world in the way that Gran Turismo is to Mario Kart, completely different fucking games this is more of a simulation whereas cruising world is more of a just a fucking good time bud it's just a good time and you're just like, yeah, if, I, if you want to have a good time you play cruising world if you want to play r4 ridge racer type 4 sweet game simulate it uh the next one it's tax season so 
everybody's thinking about what to make in terms of video games for the tax season. Uh, we're all worried. We're all thinking, oh, shit, taxes. I don't even know how to spell it. T-A-C-K-S? What? So nobody knows anything about taxes. That's the fucking truth. If they did, then they wouldn't make us fucking do it every week, year. Um, it's, <laughs> I wish it's, uh, so the, the 973rd game is not tax simulator. It is, um, just the, the turbo tax tax into it. Deluxe edition for 2022. Um, so no, I'm just kidding. But the game for the switch sealed will remain sealed until further notice because I have problems opening games. Shh, don't tell anyone. Don't tell a single soul. Um, so anyways, <laughs> we got Turnip Boy evades. Oh, wait, no. T- Turnip Boy commits tax evasion for the Nintendo Switch. I love this game. I love the way it looks. It's apparently like a little Zelda clone. Um, it's cute. So we got this. Look at this little little fella down there. So this is called Turnip Boy Commits Tax Evasion. Uh, something I can learn a lot from at this point in my life. So the 973rd game is Turnip Boy Commits Tax Evasion. It's a digital title as well, um, but the the physical went on sale. Um, do I still need to do my taxes and make sure, boys? Turbo Tax is free until the end of the month, so go ahead and fucking exploit. They're still gonna charge you at the end. That's a fact. Every single time that they've been like, dude, it's free to tra- free to file uh, till the end of February. I do it, and I still fucking pay top dollar. So they can suck my nuts all the way to the seventh fucking depths of hell. But regardless, it's tax season. It's time to fucking play. Turnip Boy commits tax evasion. Just kidding. Leaving it sealed. That's the fucking hall alert. I have two games. I don't know what the fuck's happening. I've I bought I've been buying games just because I'm so embarrassed about the hall alert lately. There's just nothing going on, man. The the market is trash. As as with the entire economy, the fucking game economy is trash. Nothing is good. Nothing is shooting itself at me. Um Jim has given me some good ideas. I have taken them to heart. And we may see them in future hall alerts, which is good. So we've been talking about some games. I have I have at least uh, two or three games on the way. Um, definitely not Vita games. There's no way in hell I'm buying. I'm sorry, Ian. There's no way in hell I'm buying a Vita game after I have had my Vita modded. Dude, there's, there's no way I'm buying a 3DS game. There's no way I'm buying a DS game. There's no way I'm buying a Vita game or a PSP game. All those games, they're, they're all done. Everything is situated. The entire library, done. Oh, dude, you did. I mean, Jim, I've been trying to, uh, I've been trying to get that game that we talked about, and um, you, you were the push I needed. So, uh, we'll see how, we'll see if it comes through. Um, we'll see if Mister Fraser wants to show his ugly face. I'm just kidding. His face is beautiful, and he's a beautiful man. Uh, so we'll see if that comes through. So now, because the Hall Alert has been such a stingy piece of shit. I don't know why I'm subscribed to the Elven Handjob Gaming Experience at this point. We have had to outreach. So I've had BB Cust and company outreach to... Um, oh, dude, no. The push is not going to Shadow Tower. Uh, sorry, let me let me backtrack BB Cust. Walters, I just saw Shadow Tower on Mercari. Let me go ahead and let's do a live look in at the Shadow Tower price that's out there. Uh... <laughs> Hold on, I'm getting a call. So this is unexpected, but I'm getting a call from the freaking. So we're gonna take this one live real quick. Oh, no. Hi, freaking! You're on the Elven Handjob Gaming Experience. Hey, um, this is uh, the Gamers Touch. Um, tuning in here, and um, I just wanted to express my um, <laughs> concerns over tonight's haul. Um, you got 10 seconds, sir. You got 10 seconds. Uh Uh-huh. Um, concerns are that the haul overall was, um, 10 seconds was was quite good, (laughs) actually. And (laughs) this guy's a joker, uh, man. This guy's a joker. He's calling my show. I find it concerning because as a subscriber, I expect trash hauls and, 
This, that, this guy's a joker. What do you think, chat? <laughs> that was such that was such a good haul that I I, I think I'm gonna unsubscribe. This is my lump. All right. Well, thanks for the call uh, to the gamers touch. Thanks. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, oh shit. Okay. So that obviously we'll cut that out in post. Um, <clears throat> apologize for the live audience for the colorful language that we just received on the uh, call. Um, really not sure why that happened. Um, so yeah, I apologize for that. That was uncalled for. We got, we got him out of here. Thank you to the uh, moderation squad. What's that? What's going on on the screen? Um, but thanks to the moderation team for kicking them out right in the right time. Appreciate you guys. Uh, Jesse, I apologize for the colorful language. I know we've been trying to keep that at a minimum. Um, because you know, we, uh, we just don't want to hear that in this, uh, in this, uh, dude, Shadow Tower is like $300, Walters. It's like $300. Um, <laughs> so let's go ahead and we'll call, we'll call into the Elven Hand job, or I guess it's just the Elven Hand Ethan, um, uh, phone line. So I don't have the phone number. So let me go ahead and contact once again. Um, sorry, as you know, as we, as you know, we do everything live on this show. So, um, because it's such a new hotline. Okay. So let's go ahead and call in. Hello. Thank you for calling the 11 hand Ethan stream support line. Okay. Powered by DB custom company. Thank you. Please do not listen carefully as our menu options have not recently changed. Oh my God. Press one for stream technical support. Press two for moderation related matters. I, the double need. Press three for 11 hand Ethan Empire Financial. So last time we called into the 11 hand financial, uh, we're, we're at this point. I want to, I think it's number one is the option. Okay, I guess we got George Lopez. <laughs> BB Cuss, how can I help? Oh, thank you so much for answering the call. I I I I, I fear that my um uh, my 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 speakers are a little uh, a little warped or trashed from. Don't don't worry. Okay, don't worry. thank you. All that matters is a sponsor. Um, give me one minute. I, okay. I need to follow up. I think I got one. Just hold on. Okay. Thank you so much, BB Kiss. Oh, that's nice. I kind of dig that. Oh. Okay. A little strange. Okay. Oh. Yes. Our sponsor for the evening is Mmm -mm Pizza. Oh, thank God. And mm -mm, I love that pizza. Oh, that's mm -mm good news. Pizza? Th that's good to get. Don't forget about their carryout deals. Okay. And just talk about them. Love them. Wait, don't, love don't give me the read. This is a natural thing. This should be a natural thing. I don't. You're supposed to send me the goddamn script off camera. I'm live right now, BB Cuss. I'm live. Okay, I'm done with this. I did my part. You do yours. Oh, shit. So once again, obviously, we're not in the good graces of BB Cuss and company. Honestly, I don't know why we employ them anymore. It's getting a little fucked. The situation is getting fucked. So obviously, we have, I mean, obviously. And I'm going to say obviously because obviously we have... Mm -mm pizza as one of our sponsors and boy howdy if you guys like sweet sauce mwah. if you guys like good cheese mwah. if you guys like a good toppingless base i'm talking the bread the dough the ingredients the ingredients if you're talking if you're if you're gonna be an italian you gotta spin it in an italian sense and they got more fucking they got more meats that end in i than i got eyes that end in my face you know what i'm talking about so uh, 
you should be convinced because here's the thing we have some takeout specials such as monday through thursday a takeout special uh 8.99 bags you a large cheese pizza every day from monday to thursday and then there's Tuesday and Wednesday in between if you want fucking pie every goddamn night. Friday, go out and have a good time. Saturday, recover. Sunday, think about it. Monday, go ahead and get your pie again. That's the whole alert. Um, I don't... You know, right now, at this point, I'm sorry for one call. And I'm embarrassed for the second call. I should have gotten that read way beforehand. So, it's something that we're going to have to work on. It's something that... As a professional team, obviously, we do everything. Oh, we're getting one more call in um, from another viewer. So let's go ahead and take this call real quick. Hi, you're on the 11 Hand Man stream. Hi. Oh. I just wanted to call, call in. <laughs> hold on, sir. Please hold on. Okay. Go ahead. You're, you're live. Oh, I'm live. Well, <laughs> I just wanted to call in. I noticed during the hall alert, hall alert excuse me. Yeah, uh-huh. it's not a wart. Um, <laughs> unfortunately, I'm wart free. I wish I had more warts to give, but go ahead. Don't we all? <laughs> but, sir, I wanted to give a little fun fact based on a future game that you teased. Okay. So, Excellent. Brendan Fraser nearly lost his life while filming the hanging scene. And according to Rachel Weiss, he stopped breathing and had to be resurrected. Now, but his colleagues didn't fare much better. Everyone on the set was required to drink a specially created beverage every two hours in order to stay hydrated. And numerous crew members were hospitalized <laughs> by poisonous animals. That would be all for now. Goodbye. Well, there you have it. So a saving grace from our last caller. Thank you so much. Peter Clavin is the number I have on the caller ID, so I appreciate it. Um, so thank you so much for that call. That is an important tidbit of information. We're going to talk about it more in the Hall Alert in the uh, preceding weeks here, depending on our USPS scheduling. Um, everything about the whole, you know, the world at large. Things are changing, things are moving, things are happening, things are getting done, things are not getting done. So at the end of the day, we're going to have some more games coming in. A thousand games by the end of 2022 might be a possibility at this point. We have 27 games left. And at this point, hold on, don't talk to me about going idle, you stupid fucking play. This stupid Xbox is so goddamn stupid. Um, that's the whole alert. Enjoy your time. Enjoy your enjoy your pizza from Mm Pizza, our sponsor of the evening. And fellas, let's go ahead and kick some more ass child style. <laughs> <laughs>